Hey guys, how are you today? Um, I wanted to come on and show you guys some of the Hobby Lobby clearance that I got um, this week. And just talk to you guys for a little bit. Tell you a little bit about what I've been up to lately, which honestly isn't <laughs> very much. Um, kids finished school and... They did really good. My daughter brought all her grades up to straight A's. Um, and my youngest daughter, she's been doing really good at school too. I'm really proud of her. She's having a hard time read, learning to read and stuff. And now she's reading all the time and she's doing really great. Um, so summer's officially started here. Um, so we just, you know, we've been going to the park and getting out and taking walks and all the normal fun stuff. Lots of crocheting and movie nights and staying up late. Um, my, my girls love to have movie nights. We're actually having one tonight. I went out and bought stuff to make ice cream sundaes and tacos for dinner. And we're going to watch Sing 2 together. Um, I have a 13-year-old a and a 10-year-old girls. Um, I also have a 17-year-old boy, but he's older and never wants to hang out with me. So <laughs> my girls mostly hang out with me. So, yeah. But, um, so we went out to Hobby Lobby last week. I, my husband didn't want to go, but... <laughs> Please, they only do it once a year. I need to go to the sale. So um, we went out there. We took the girls with us and we ended up going out to lunch too. So it was a really nice trip. Um, so I will show you what I got. Okay, so I didn't get very much. Um, I've been trying to save my money because we are buying a car right now. So, yeah, I'm trying not trying to stay on budget. Plus, I have way too much yarn. This week, I'm actually going to be doing like a whole renovation of my room. <laughs> not really renovation. That's not the right word, I guess. Just like I'm going through all my yarn and my closet's full of yarn, and I have tons of shelves full of yarn and we're just gonna like go through it all, reorganize it, like get rid of some stuff that I just know that I'm not gonna use and just not into anymore. Um, so yeah, I will try to take pictures or videos and try to show you guys, you know, the before and after what it looks like. Um, yeah, so I got some of this tweed indeed. It's originally $5.99. I got it for $1.49. It's, it's colorway chambray tween. I think that's what it's called. <laughs> Let's see. It's 180 yards for three and a half ounces. It's 46% acetate and 46% yeah, 46% acetate, 46% cotton, 6% viscose, 2% polyester. And it's a number four. And it uses a 5 millimeter knitting needle and a 5.5 crochet hook. Oh yeah, I thought that was really pretty. It's got these tweedy little bits. <laughs> so it's, it's really soft too. So I got four of those. And then I found these sweet minis. Hold on one second. Okay, so I found these sweet minis. Really pretty colors. Um, so these, this is color Roses and Clouds. It's 300 yards and it's 100% acrylic, um, 4.2 ounces, and it's a lightweight three. 
use a four millimeter knitting needle or a five millimeter crochet. It's got like this shine on it. It's really pretty. And this one actually now that you can see a light better. You can see this a lot better. And then I found one of the Halloween, oh, I'm joking, one of the Halloween ones, uh, the Sweet Minis, it's fall, y'all. Um, these were $4.29 down to $1.07. 4.2 ounces, 300 yards, 100% acrylic, and a lightweight three. I love those colors, too. So pretty. Let's go here. <laughs> I can't wait to make something Halloween. -y. And then I've been wanting to try these for a long time, um, but they're kind of expensive, so I ended up finding one in clearance. It's the Chloe yarn, um, blue hues, and it's six ninety nine, and I got it for dollar seventy four. Three and a half ounces, 100 grams, 270 yards, 70% wool, 30% viscose. That's a number four. You use a six millimeter hook or a five millimeter knitting needle. So yeah, it's really pretty. I think it has like maybe other colors too. I can't really tell. No, but it's really pretty. You can definitely feel the wool but it's still really soft on the skin too, so that's pretty nice. I'm like, I love wool, <clears throat> but uh, my skin's like sensitive, so I can't use like really it, like itchy wool, like real wool. Um, so this is one of the hand dye pinks. $14.99 originally. I got it for $3.74. It's marble teal. Three and a half ounce, 400 yards. 100% super wash merino wool. It's a number one super fine. Use 2.5 needle or a three millimeter crochet hook. I love this hand dyed yarn. I love making shawls, cardigans, all kinds of stuff. I have to say, like, my favorite yarn weights is definitely like a one and a three right now. So, so then I got this one. It's so sparkly. <laughs> Um, so, you know, $14.99, I got it for $3.74, this one's called November Sky, it's got 100 grams for 120 yards, 99% super wash marina wool, and 1% metallic, super fine one, so yeah, that's so pretty, let's see here. So then I got two of these. And these are both April showers. I'll hold one up. Um, 100 grams, 420 yards, 99 super wash window wool, and 1% metallic polyester. It's a super, wa super fine one. And that's April showers. And then the last thing I got was these two. And this is called Cool Watermelon. And it's the same 99 Super Wash Marina Wool, 1% metallic polyester, 420 yards, super fine number one. I thought this one was really pretty too. It's all sparkly and beautiful summer colors. 
Um, so yeah, that's it for the Hobby Lobby stuff. And then I just wanted to show you guys quick. Um, I had got a Yarnable. I'm on the Yarnable subscription. And it wasn't this month's, but I think last month's. Look at how cute this is. <laughs> little avocados working out um so it came with this little pin and then the bag of course so then it always comes with this card and it's like um, yeah, so this is May 2022. Um, it's called the Avocardio. Um, it was brought to you by Guacamole Retro Headbands and Leg Warmers. And it came with the Avocardio Notion Bag, Avocado Enamel Pin, Avocardio Stitch Marker, and um, oh, yeah, that's it. Okay. And there's always like a little scratch off code. Um, yeah, so. And here's the yarn. It's so pretty. Just look at the colors. It's like, oh my gosh, it's so gorgeous. So I'm gonna definitely be making my husband some socks with this. He loves green, so he's pretty excited to get some socks with this. So, um, yeah, so it's really all I have. Actually, you know, I don't know if I ever showed you guys this. This is one of my older Yarnable yarns that I haven't used yet. This is one of my favorite colorways. I'm not sure if I've ever showed you guys this or not, but it's stuff on it. This one's so pretty. I cut unwound and I'm <laughs> not very good at winding yarn. But I'm going to be caking this up for some socks. I haven't decided if I want to do socks with this or maybe like a cowl. But something very soon with that because I love it. So, yeah, that's really all I've got going on. Um, I'm going to be working on the test that I'm doing for Hannah at the Cozy Cottage Crochet a bunch, trying to get that done. Um, trying to finish up the one step socks that I am doing. Um, I can't remember if I told you guys the pattern, so I guess I'll just show you again quick in case I didn't, um, and I'll try to link it in the description box below too. So this is the One Step Socks, I believe they're called, by um, Earth Tones Girl. I need to get some sock blockers, but <laughs> it shows you the pattern a little better. It's like a little cabling pattern and then plain vanilla over here. And I did the slip stitch heel flap. But yeah, so alright. Well thanks for watching guys. It was nice talking to you. Um, I don't know, I'll be back on soon to show you some more progress on my webs. And I hope everyone has a great afternoon. Um, please like, share, and subscribe. Have a great day. Bye, guys.